You related to old man Randell? He's my grandfather. He was a genuine monster. This is Brian with ScreenFiles.com and Trailer Interaction. What I'm looking at today is the official trailer for Spin the Bottle, which according to IMDb revolves around a group of young people who play the game of Spin the Bottle where a grisly massacre happened and they've awakened some kind of spirits or whatever. On the face of it, this sounds like the dumbest premise. And don't confuse that with the movie is bad. It might be great. I haven't seen it, I don't know. But the premise is stupid. I'm not a person that believe in ghosts. You know why? Because I'm willing to wager that so many people have died in every country of the world to bring us to where we are today that if ghosts were to exist, they'd be all over the place. There are so many people who are massacred. Look what's going on in Gaza. There are so many people that are killed unjustly. There are so many terrible fucking things happening all the time, all over the place, that the idea that this one event with these young people would trigger some evil spirit or force is once again stupid. It is the dumbest shit. And to be fair with this movie, it's not an uncommon story device. You see it a lot. But once again, it's just dumb and insulting. Though what bothers me about it most of all, it is incredibly ahistoric. In any case, let's look at the official trailer for Spin the Bottle. I wanted to say Kiss the Girls because Spin the Bottle tends to be a game where you have a bunch of people sitting in a circle and they have like a beer bottle or a wine bottle and they spin it. And when it points at two individuals, those individuals would kiss. It's a game seemingly designed to make people comfortable, to get people reacting to each other through kissing and that type of thing. In any case, let's look at the official trailer for Spin the Bottle. Where are we? Isn't this the house that all those murders happened at? That chick blew their heads off. They're playing Spin the Bottle. Spin. Not usually the result of spin the bottle. We are never going to forget this night. What the? Cole Nichols? You know a girl named Mila Jane? Mila got in an Uber here. Exited the vehicle about a half mile down the road. Nobody's seen her since. You related to old man Randell? He's my grandfather. He was a genuine monster. There were rumors about your family. Am I a suspect? You tell me. Are you actually a Randell? You need to end this. You have to destroy it. That kid and his family brought nothing but death to our town. Yeah! Sophie, come out! Yo, who's there? Let's play. Well, that was the trailer for Spin the Bottle, and it is literally nothing we haven't seen before. Once again, that's not to say it's bad or it will be bad, I have no idea. But it appears fairly predictable. Though what I find interesting is that it stars Justin Long, who is known more for his comedic chops than his dramatic ones. And that's something I wouldn't mind seeing because I think he's a very good actor. But that being said, this movie, it'll probably be fine. Nothing more, nothing less. Though what do you think? This is Brian with ScreenFiles.com and Trailer Into Reaction. Do you agree, disagree? Let me know down below. And as usual, consider a like or a follow. Peace.